And so just kind of like things like, well, like my team, I think is just going to like better for me, better for my development. And I'd say just from there, it's just like not like, obviously I care what people think, but if they're like judging you for like the decisions and you think that they're maybe trying to hold you back, you don't have to like cut them out of your life. Just like don't listen to them as like their opinions on stuff like that. I would just saying it's whatever your goals are, you have to strive to do what's best for you. And, you know, sometimes it might make some people upset or you might have to lose some people for it. But if it's truly your goal and that's what you want, like I would say definitely push for it. Well, and I always say, I always told my kids, especially in high school, these people aren't going to pay your bills. When you got to go into the real world, no matter what they've said, what they've done, they're they're not the ones that's going to have to write that paycheck uh, off to pay for the house that you want to live in, drive the cars you want to live in. So, of course, you're now going through the process with Kentucky. You're getting to do that right before then. What was the biggest change that you think was your make from going from high school to, to getting to the college level? I would say definitely the intensity of work is a huge change. You go from like high school practice and someday you might be like, man, that, that high school practice was kind of tough. Like your hardest high school practice will be a cakewalk practice for you in college. Like, especially when you're in those 20 hour weeks, like you need to be ready to do, have a three and a half hour practice to go straight into your hour and a half lift, go back to the classroom for a film review. And then maybe if you like want to take that next step, you're going to like do your own individual film review with that, with the coach and like, all of a sudden you're like, man, I was at the field for seven hours today. Now, when it comes to these coaches, are they coming to ask you to do these things? Or is this something just like with every other college thing? If you're not asking, they're not going to be providing a lot of it either. Yeah, it's definitely a, you have to go ask. And but they they want you to ask. But if you're not willing to like reach out and like maybe step out of your comfort zone, like with that coach that's like fairly new to you, like they're not going to be like, like, yo, Eli, let's, let's go look at your catching video today. Like, let's see how you looked catching this guy. It's going to be like, 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 yo, coach, like, can we take a look at that? Can you, like, show me, like, some things I was doing good, some things I need to work on? Maybe go show me a couple drills that will, like, help me with that.